Hello viewers, welcome to the way to learn. Can you read Roman numerals? Well, this video will show you how. I am Monastery. Today we will discuss how to write Roman numerals. Roman numerals are a numeral system that originated in ancient Rome. It is still used in many places. Roman numerals provide a new representation of numbers. We have just these seven different Roman numerals. By combining them, you can make any other numbers. Let's have a look. Let's know these seven Roman numerals. Here, I is denoted as 1, V as 5, X as 10, L as 50, C as 100, D as 500, and M as 1000. Do you think this is difficult to remember? If you think so, then I have a trick for you. Here it is. Just try to remember this line. I value x-rays. Let's count doctor's money. Please, don't try to find any meaning behind this. This is just a trick. I is 1 value is V here that is 5 X rays is X that's 10 let's here it is L that is 50 count gives you C that is 100 doctors gives you D that is 500 money as 1000 I can bet if you remember this you will never forget the values here using seven different Roman numerals we can find the value of other Roman numerals. Here is your rule 1. When we write different Roman numerals together, then we actually add the value. How? Let's see. Here, this is I, I, I. So, I means 1. So, when we write I, 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 that means 1 plus 1 plus 1 equal to 3. This is VI. V is 5. I is again 1. So, VI means 5 plus 1. Actually, we are adding the values here. Next is XV. X means 10. V is 5. So, XV means 10 plus 5. That is 15. Now, XVII. X is 10. V, 5. I, I means 1 plus 1, 10 plus 5, 15, plus 1, 16, plus 1, 17. Now, L, L is 50. So, L, X, V means 50 plus 10 plus 5. 50 plus 10, 60, plus 5, that is 65. Again, for the next example, we are adding the numbers. C L X V I. C means 100. L means 50. X is 10. V is 5. I is 1. 100 plus 50 is 150. Plus 10, 60. Plus 5, 65. Plus 1, 166. Don't you think this is easy? Now, proceed to the next rule. When we write bigger number than the smaller number, then actually we make addition. Let's have an example. V i. Here v is 5, i is 1. So v is greater than 1, that is i. So we are adding the values. 5 plus 1 equals to 6. When, when we write smaller number than the bigger number, then we made subtraction. Here, I, V. I is smaller than V. So, we are make subtraction. That is V minus I, that is 5 minus 1 equals to 4. Okay? Let's take another example of same rule. X, C. What is X? 10. What is C? 100. So, 
x is smaller than c so the value is 100 minus 10 that is 90 again cx c is 100 x is 10 so we are here adding the values you must notice that in both of the cases i made the subtraction from the bigger number to smaller number right yes the smaller one has come first and then the bigger one but i made the subtraction from bigger to smaller why because roman number do not provide negative number now let's proceed to the rule number three here we will learn how to derive the value of a big roman numerals here in this example let's start from the left side the value of c is 100 and d is 500 as we are moving from smaller to bigger so as rule number two we made subtraction so the bigger comes first then minus the smaller one because we do not want negative value in roman numerals okay then come x and l x is 10 and l is 50 again the smaller to bigger so here we will do again subtraction so x comes here and l comes here 50 minus 10 then v i v i means 5 to 1 bigger to smaller so here we will do addition that is 5 plus 1 so let's compute 500 minus 100 that is 400 50 minus 10 that is 40 5 plus 1 that is 6 400 plus 40 440 plus 6 446 okay in this rule, rule we learn how to derive the numeric value of roman numerals let's understand the rule number four do not repeat any roman numerals more than three times but the symbols v l and d are never repeated let's have some examples 60 60 means 50 plus 10 that is l x 70 50 plus 10 plus 10 that is l x x 80 means 50 plus 10 plus 10 plus 10 that is l x x and x so we have already repeated x three times here that's why when we write 90 then it do not write 50 plus 10 plus 10 plus 10 plus 10 no we will write 100 minus 10 as 90 obviously this is simpler also and how we will write the roman numerals as we know in case of this the smaller number comes first then the bigger number that is x and c so 90 is x c okay now let's practice together in this examples we will derive roman numerals from the numbers first one is 73 first we will break the numbers 73 as 50 plus 10 plus 10 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 so 50 means l 10 is x again x then i i i means 1 plus 1 plus 1 okay so 73 is l x x i i i 96 90 means 100 minus 10 plus 5 plus 1 
So in subtraction, the smaller will come first, then the bigger one. So 100 minus 10 is x c, 5 is v, and i is 1. So 96 as x c v i. Let's have a big number 1746. We will break this number in this way 1000 plus 700 plus 40 plus 6. Again, the 700 will break as 500, 100 plus 100 and 40 as 50 minus 10. Okay? As 6 as 5 plus 1. Now, derive the Roman numerals. 1000, M, then 500 as D, 100 two times as C, 50 means L and 10 is X. Again, smaller to bigger, so it will be XL. 5 plus 1, that is VI. So, 1746 will be MDCCXL. V I. Thank you for watching this video. Hope you like it. Please do not forget to subscribe, like and share my channel. And don't forget to press the bell icon. See you in my next video.